my daughter. You don't do not stop. Are you kidding me? Yeah, you, that's, that's what we're doing. I'm calling my husband. Ma'am, this is crazy. You guys are hiding documentation, so I'd like that. Well, you can't arrest somebody without reading their rights. Uh, she was just so belligerent and so irate. That's what I'm dealing with this morning. What's up, everybody? In today's video, we have another psycho entitled Karen getting arrested. Now, this one didn't understand the simple concept of trespassing, and she got arrested at a school. Now, without further ado, let's get right into it. Going nowhere. We're going to talk about you decide like an adult. I wasn't talking to her. Okay. And I wasn't doing that. So before you come in, you can listen to my part too, because that is a part of a Okay, program. we're going to stop right there. No. Because no, this is, I'm, I'm going to no. tell you right now how it works. She's the principal of this property. She gets to say who gets on this property. Okay, so she well, says, you got to go. like that. But you got to go. No, I'm not going nowhere because. Then, then you're going to be arrested for trespassing. No, then you need to call the cops because that's not Oh, ma'am, I am a police officer. And I don't need you. Okay. So you could don't talk to me. I'm with my daughter. No, I'm leaving. My daughter, you do not stop. Are you kidding me? Yeah, that's what we're doing. If you fight, ma'am, it's I'm not fighting you, but you can so let go of me. No, I was you're under my daughter, and I'm no, leaving. absolutely not. We're not doing this. I'm calling my husband, ma'am. This is crazy. I'm, I'm, I'm being arrested because you guys let my daughter get spit on. Stop. I'm not, I'm not stop calling my husband. Stop. Stop. You're hurting me. Stop. We'll stop fighting. I want the cameras of this. Stop. Oh, it's I think you're enjoying this. Stop. You're enjoying it. Ma'am, you're making it worse for yourself. I'm not stop. Doing nothing. You, my wallet is in the way. I'm not dropping my wallet. Drop it. It's gonna be I'm gonna pick it up. Ma'am. I'm trying to try. I'm trying my best to not hurt you. Well, but if you keep fighting, this is gonna be on you. You guys enjoy this? This is crazy. Ma'am. I'm not gonna tell you again. I'm stop moving for you to do stop. that. You're the one having a panic attack. You can't control your rack around my shirt. It, can you your stop rack around my shirt? There you go. You can't see it. Stop. Okay, then. Well, because okay, I want the documents for my daughter. I hope you guys have a good time in court. And paperwork should be documented too. That you guys are legal. Everything is school. on my camera, so don't you worry. Okay. Everything is all set. I know, and I told you guys that you had a teacher spit in my daughter's face. Ma'am. Okay, and you did not contact okay. me. Have a seat. You got my shirt wrapped up into it. I don't like got my butt. Okay, so sit down. thank you. I would like my phone to call my husband Five, too. Six. And I want the documents in about my my daughter being spit on by a person, and I wasn't notified about that. Can you drop me? You guys are hiding documentation, so I'd like that. And I'm glad you guys dismissed her yesterday, but you should have notified me. That's all I wanted. But you guys can't. You came in here like you missed hot shot and shit. Trust us after morning. And you have them twisted, so that's why it's not going on right now. Okay, because you, you panicked and had a, like an anxiety there no, attack. There's no panic. No, you didn't need there's to no go panic. that far. You're just I asked, a hole for yourself. No, I didn't. So you can ask that lady right there. Sit I down. said I wanted to have a conversation. I'm not sitting down. I'm sitting fine. down. I fine. leaned forward that is and said I wanted to have the conversation in the back. You guys, she got some stuff up her ass, and then you came in here with your mouth. Okay. We're you guys didn't. Go ahead. We're going to go to my car. Let's go. And by the way, you're going to be in trouble for like not having somebody arrested. Sure, man. Absolutely. Absolutely. Whatever you say. Don't push me. You fix my shirt, my stomach. No, stomach. absolutely not. We're going to go don't to the back of my car. Ma'am, I'm don't not push me. You're pushing me. Stop. No. I'm no walking. No you're me. pushing me. Stop. Stop. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Do you have this. anything on you that's going to poke me, stick me, hurt me? You didn't read me my rights. I don't need to read your rights. I'm not asking you any questions about any criminal Well, you activity. can't arrest somebody without reading their rights. Uh now, this is a huge problem. This woman is clearly suffering from the Dunning-Kruger effect. She's extremely confident about her knowledge about the law, even though it's completely wrong. Her understanding of Miranda rights is almost as good as her understanding of trespassing laws. It's not how it works, man. But yeah, sure, I think you watch too much TV. Wrong. Do you have any other things? Any pockets? Anything on you? Five six seven six. Five seven six. Go ahead. Hey, I'm gonna need you to write in your stamps, please. Yeah, I'm still getting a time. Uh, ninety four. You should ask for backup too. Oh, oh man, I'm stuck. I'm okay. gonna hurt everybody so bad. Okay, I'll make sure to note that in my report. So. I would like you to call my husband too while you're at it. 
because they're the only ones that pick up my children. I am. She's just mouthy, that's all. I'm not mouthy. You disrespect me on top of the other crates in there. Before you drive something away. in there? You want to go get? Um, I have Raquina on the way over. I'm just trying to turn on the AC so she doesn't die in here. So, all I asked her was like, ma'am, calm down. And she's like, I'm not going anywhere. Oh, I'm like, ma'am. You need to take it down a notch because all you're going to do is you're just bringing yourself. This is not how it works. You don't come in here and scream and cause a disturbance. You need an ID. So she continues. Yeah. So she, she's, I mean, she's going off. So I was like, okay, we're not doing that. She's mouthing off. So it's like, if you're not going to leave, then I'm going to arrest you for trespass after warning. It's, it's really that simple. So she decided to mouth off if she's doing right now. And well, that's where we're at. So. Park, I wouldn't even, I hadn't got that information because she wouldn't even speak to me, so. Yeah. What is it? Is it something with school? She upset about something? Couldn't even get that information oh. from her. She was just so belligerent and so irate mm -hmm. that it was like, ma'am, I can't, I can't help you if you don't talk to me. But no, she wanted to. Gotcha. Yeah. And she's like, call the cops. I'm like, ma'am, I I am. Yeah. I was like, ma'am, I, I am. I'm trying to help you, but whatever. Okay. I have some six on two. I'll go inside so there's other stuff you can. Yeah, please, thank you. I need you to run one by name and New York State learner permit, if that's possible. They said this is uh, it's on the desk. So I must okay. her keys or something. Yeah. I don't want to go through. Well, I got it because she's under arrest. But, um, can you have Miss Hawthorne come out here to me? I need to ask her. Yeah. Yeah. Or just the or yeah. No, it has to be Hawthorne because she's going to be the one that has to officially trespass. But does she still have a kid coming to school here? And that's why I got. I got. She's not going to cooperate. So I'm going to try to get the information from her, her husband and, or someone. <laughs> So I wanted to take this time to have a very quick moment of silence because somewhere out there, there is a man that is married to this hag. Now, I don't know how she convinced him. Maybe it's through witchcraft or some type of spell, but I really feel bad for the guy. Okay, awesome. And I, I will have that conversation with him and I'll let him know what's going on. So listen, now that now that you've calmed down, okay, I, I need to ask you a few questions if that's okay, right? Because you have to understand why I took the action that I took, right? No. Okay, so uh, no, me, I don't so, agree with you. Okay, so so here's the thing, right? When you're so belligerent. I wasn't believing okay, until okay, she confronted okay, me. Stop. Okay, Listen, go are you going to let me camera. finish or do I have to roll the window again? But you guys aren't listening to you're, you're what in, I have to you're say. You're talking over me and you're interrupting me. You're doing the I, same as thing. As you did when you were inside. This is what landed you okay. under arrest to begin with, You did that to me man. inside. Okay. You did the same thing okay. I was You know what? Inside. Since this is not going to happen, then we have nothing left to say. One, one, three, five, four, pound. You ready? one one three five four pound. That's what I'm dealing with this morning. Good morning. Hey. So hey. um hey. Look at you. <laughs> so all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna roll down the window. Yeah. All you have to say is your trespass. Yeah, I yeah, will take yeah. care of the no trespass worries. form yeah, and we yeah. don't have to do anything else. Ms. Hawkins just has something to say. Hi, I just wanted to let you know you're not welcome on the campus here being trespass. Oh, good job. You could go fuck yourself. Have a great day. Got some real hair. Wow. <laughs> okay, so let me get started on the Viper. If you want to, actually, you know what? My computer is inside. Want to log in some more? Huh? Want to log in? Yeah, tomorrow? I'm trying to know my password by heart. I'm going to stay with her while you're going. Yeah, just stay with her. Um, let me unlock it, and then I'll. I'll let you know. Uh, Actually, I can sit there in my car. Yeah, let you want to put her in your car instead? Yeah, I'm going to put her in my car, do your thing, call PTU, and then, and then I can message you when it, PTU yeah. is ready. Beautiful. 
Okay, so... I'll hear you in the radio when you say PTU, and I'll, and I'll tell PTU to meet me in the back. 576, I'm sorry, are you calling? 10 ma'am, I'm showing 54, 29, 54, back. 10 four, thank you. You're coming with me. Yep, I know, I heard you. Let's go. You just, I just want to pick my pants up. Like, I don't know if that's an issue. You want to pick your pants up? I do. Okay. It takes two seconds. I just don't want my lady lump stuff falling out of here. Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm asking what you, uh, what you want. This is twisted, too. That's why it kind of hurts. Thank you. Just, it's actually the front. Because my, my, would you like me my, to do it? Or yeah, like, my baby one. Okay, I don't there want you that go. baby one. So, okay, that's fine. You Bring have. Oh, thank you. Okay. Here, let me just put my shirt on. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. You're okay. welcome. So, all your items. Including your ID, I'm gonna take your. Where is your car parked? My car is right over there in the park. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. This um, here. And I actually, I don't know if you could do this too, but I was supposed to leave this school and go over there because there was a bomb threat over there for my son, and he's not in school right now. He's home alone. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll help you out with all that. I really can't understand these parents, whether it's a man or a woman, you have responsibilities, you have kids to take care of, but yet you're choosing to put your own psychotic behavior and your own Karen nonsense in front of the well-being and safety of your kids. It's like, just act like a civilized human for once. You'll see that you'll get a lot further in life. Watch your head, watch your step. Is this pepper spray or is this one of those? No, it's a lot. It's when you get locked under the water and you gotta pop it open. I'm gonna get a baggie for her right now. Oh, That's it? Alright, I'm gonna wait That's for it. BT in the back. Alright, sounds good. No problem. That's it? All right, I'm gonna wait That's for it. BT in the back. All right, sounds good. Appreciate you. Okay, going on. Okay, so yeah. what happened when she came in? So I walked in the side door and I heard her yelling, the side door, and I figured I'd put my stuff in, I'll come back. I told Miss Aaron I was gonna take her to the back. I came out and I said, you know, nicely, at first, hey, why don't you come to the back? She said, no, you're going to do, tell me who spit in my daughter's face. I said, we're not going to do it out here. I want you to come to the back. She said, no. And then she went on and on. You're going to blah, 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 cursing and so forth. I said, you're not going to be able to do that here. She continued on. Yes, I am, because you're going to do X, Y, Z. And I said, ma'am, if you continue, I'm going to have to put you off the campus. I'm going to trespass you. I was clear. You're not going to do blank to me, blank, blank, blank. So I called you the first time. Then I decided, okay, let me see if she'll calm down because I called her, let me see if she'll calm down. I heard your response and then I said, why don't you calm down? Like, no, you can call whoever you want to call. And and yeah. then it just, right. she continued on until you walked in. And yeah, I, I, I thought trying, she would I'm, calm down when you walked in and you could get her outside. And and I could, I could explain to her that we trespassed the sub. She's not welcome here anymore. She can't come back anymore. That I had already handled it. I was trying to. This has to, to do that. with that that cell that the was in France. That I got. Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. So if she see, I couldn't get any information. I couldn't get from anything her. either because she kept going on. If she would have given me an opportunity, I would have told her. I suspended right. the lady. She can't come back to our school. Even after anymore. she kind of semi, I don't want to say semi calmed down. After she kind of quieted down, sitting in her car, I thought right. maybe that could right. calm it. Right. She still wouldn't get. She kept saying that her daughter was spit on. Yes. So, so that was an incident where the substitute yes. teacher was yelling and yes. spitting as she talked, yes. and she yes. took it as like yes. a yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay. Yes. And I wanted to explain that to her. I didn't want to trespass, but I can't have her scaring all the rest of the parents up front. Yeah, no, that was belligerent. Yeah. And she, that was, listen, we so, did what we had to do. Yeah. Um, do we have students' names so I can at least look up information? Because she just has a New York ID. Her scholars? Her yeah, scholars, scholars name, name, yeah. Um, yes, I'll get that. Ask Ms. Kimbrough. Who's Ms. Kimbrough. The, um, the sixth grade uh, clerk. Sixth grade clerk? Okay, yep. cool. Okay. All right. Thank you. No problem. So there you have it, another Karen arrested, another one bites the dust. Unfortunately, I don't think she's going to be learning her lesson because the judge decided to drop all the charges of trespassing and resisting arrest. It is truly a shame because that will only encourage her Karen behavior. But before we wrap up, if you're a fan of the channel, I do have some great news. A couple weeks ago, 
two scumbags by the name of Resisting Arrest TV, who also operates Coffee and Donuts, as well as Officer Sparky and Midwest Cop Cam, tried to get my channel illegally terminated with false DMCA takedowns known as copyright strikes. So after a long process, YouTube has reinstated the videos and removed the false strikes. And I wanted to share this with you guys because this just proves how you cannot stand down to bullies. If there are scum bags that are trying to get your channel illegally terminated through illegal means such as false dmca takedowns you need to fight it all the way because people are very envious in this world they get jealous very quick and you cannot let them destroy what you work so hard for if anybody else is having issues with scumbags like these ones who are doing false copyright strikes feel free to reach out to me and i'll be more than happy to help now thanks so much for watching everybody i hope you enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys on the next one